In this video, we're going to demonstrate how to change out standard three-way switches with Clairview Lighting's three-way Z-Wave enabled switches. So the first thing we're going to do is flip the circuit breaker so there's no power to the switch. Then we are going to remove the cover plate. Now in a typical switch, we can tell wiring by the orientation of the switch. In a three-way switch, you cannot. So we need to physically remove the switch, examine and test the wiring, and determine what is the master and what is the accessory locations. Now on a three-way switch, you're going to have four wires connected to the switch. One on the black side, left side, which is typically your black or hot, your ground, and then red and white. Colors may vary, but you usually have three different colored screw lugs. In a standard three-way switch, common is 99% of the time the black lug, but we don't know that for certain, so what we want to do is test it. Unfortunately, we have to have the power on to test it, so we want it out of the box, make sure none of the wires are touching the box, and we're going to go ahead and we're going to turn power back on. Okay, so we flip the breaker back on, and what we're going to do is set our meter to AC voltage and test between the ground wire and the two lugs on the side. So we're going to touch ground, touch our top lug, which has power, bottom lug does not, again top has power. So if we show power on the top lug and the lights are off, we know this is our accessory switch. It's very important to make sure the lights are off and then we test our power. I'm going to go ahead and flip the breaker back off and we're going to start changing out the switch.